Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and this is Urvashi and in today's video, I am going to design the second screen for the concept I have uh, designed in my previous video which is skincare products app. So in today's video, I am going to design only one screen uh, like I did in my previous video and I have added this onboarding screen after I have recorded my uh, previous video. Uh, just to add one more screen to that so without any further delay let's get started so first of all i'm going to pick uh, one of these products and i will just uh, place the image of it to this frame okay so you can uh, follow along with me and i will explain uh, important steps if needed so let's get started so first of all i'm going to pick a icon for the uh, back button i am using this uh, icon set only that's why i will pick the same one i will turn on the layout grid so that i can align everything properly I will place this particular icon inside of a circle. I will place it like this and I will select both of them by holding shift key and click on command plus G or control plus G to group them. Now I will uh, change the color of the circle to white and add some drop shadow with less opacity like this. Okay, now I will place this here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick any of these and place inside of this particular um, frame. I have used simple uh, images for the home screen but uh, it doesn't matter. We can use colorful images in the products page UI because I have seen so many websites uh, where they, uh, they have used colorful images in their home page and simple images on their products page so it's up to you how you can approach this particular screen and uh, some of you uh, asking me were asking me uh, where i take these images from i take them from the official website of these uh, products or i take this from nika or maybe amazon so you can try that as well uh, you can find the images very easily on Nika, Amazon or on Google or on the uh, brand's official website. So th that's how I find the images for these products. Okay. I'm going to add this wishlist icon at the top as well.
follow along with me for the better understanding. I will take the name for this product from this website. Uh, this is a glow recipe website and this was the product I have added on that uh, product CUI page. I cannot copy the name so I will just type the name. Watermelon Glow I will also add some line height to it and I will add the name of the brand of the name Now what I am going to do is I am going to add the ratings to the product. You can copy the element by holding option key or alt key and just drag the uh, any of the element you want to duplicate. Follow along with me. These steps are very basic so I am not explaining them. You can just follow along so that you can understand everything by yourself. Now I am going to add the price for this product. Now I am going to add the different sizes that this product will come in. I will take the sizes from this official website. I will add some corner radius to this as well. Okay. 
okay now i am going to add the product details or product description i will take the description from here only now i will add the cta for add to cart and for that i will create a frame first of all like this the product description is hiding behind this uh, frame but no worries i am here just to explain how you can design your own app concept very easily screen is uh, done is completed and you can see i have kept this screen very straight forward very simple and beautiful looking so that's how you can create your own app concept i will design more of the screens for this particular app concept in my coming videos and also i'm going to change the images of the product for this page and you will see those changes uh on my thumbnail because i guess it it will look more beautiful if i add some colorful pictures instead of these uh, uh white background pictures so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you find this helpful then do give the video your thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and hit that like button and do not forget to follow me on instagram and linkedin link is in the description and i will see you all in my next video bye bye